Hello viewers. In this video I will demonstrate how you can run Microsoft Windows programs in Linux. Basically you need Wine and on top of that you can use Play on Linux. The best way to get a little familiar with Wine and Play on Linux is go to their websites. You can go to winehq.org and it explains what wine is, what it is, what it does, etc. And Play on Linux is a nice shell which makes use of wine and it has a small, more or less small app store which makes it easy to download some applications and to run it uh, directly. So please visit their, their websites for more information. So what we do now is to install Play on Linux. And if you install Play on Linux, automatically you install Wine. In my case, I have to type this command. Up, get install Play on Linux in one word. And if you have another Linux distribution, basically we need another command line. But for Debian based Linux distributions this is the, the command line. I already installed it to speed up this video. Um, I discovered you're not finished yet. You need actually another program. It's a font, uh, a Microsoft Office font. It's not by default installed on your Linux system. So basically we also need to install that font. Sorry, sudo apt get install ttf ms core fonts installer. So this one is also needed to run it You have to confirm an end user license agreement. I select OK. Do you accept? Yes, accept. It downloads the fonts and installs it. So now we are complete with the installation part. So basically you have installed uh, Play on Linux and also Wine. After installation you get two new environments here. A new section, Wine and it has some subsections. You can browse your C drive, it's part of your normal drive, but uh, Microsoft uh, needs uh, it's a letter, letter and a drive. You can configure Wine. If you click this uh, button it will start um, a configuration panel. Notepad is your, your default program, a uh, showcase program that Wine is working and if you have installed programs you can install it here. You can also run Notepad from the command line. If you type in Wine, in this case Notepad, it will start the program. And there you are. As you can see, Notepad Microsoft. I close this one. Now we want to install extra programs. In that case I go to games, section games and go to play on Linux. Play on Linux 
actually uh, has a, a lot of games to play but of course you can also run normal programs. Click install and you'll get a nice more or less app store if we will have a card game spider solitaire select install and wait for a second hit next One small disadvantage I found for Wine and Play on Linux is that it's not a multi-user environment, so for each user on your system you should repeat the same steps. It's installed, as you can see. It's also on my desktop. Here, you can see it also. If you select, you can run the program. There you go. Play your card game. I leave it for for now. This is basically a demonstration of play on Linux and how to run programs on Linux, Microsoft programs on Linux. You can also install other programs which not in the in the store. You have to click this section next and you can choose the source of your program and install it also. This was my demonstration, hope you enjoyed it, 